from now on I will go to sleep before 12. My morning routines is that I'm, I have to wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning. I wake up straight away. When the alarm is ringing, I jump out of my bed and then I'm going and having a shower. And then I do, I take one half a liter of uh, water and I drink it. And uh, then I'm leaving the house. I'm going for a walk. I got so many ideas, my mind become richer and I started to think about what I was going to do and in, in a creative ways, I got so many ideas and uh, I couldn't fall asleep and um, probably I fall asleep uh, around 5 a.m. and I was supposed to get up at uh, 6 a.m. so um, when the alarm clock was ringing at 6 a.m. I turned it off and uh, I woke up at uh, 7.50 instead but of course it uh, depends which eyes who is viewing but uh, in a way uh, still early but instead I will uh, I will go for a walk a small walk around the neighborhood I see the the the, the thing that uh, I once in a while have uh, a challenge uh, to fall asleep is a part of uh, the paradigm uh, shift I'm doing now. So uh, I will also work around that issue as well. I have been lightening this scene. I have uh, my uh, non-light Forza 60B behind my camera now. 
because uh, very often when uh, you have a window as a background and uh, no lighting then um, the subject become very dark and uh, you have a boring picture so that's why I'm doing it This macro lens, I bought it uh, for some years ago for my uh, Samsung NX1. But then, when I bought uh, my Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera, I uh, I wanted to get it, get that 50 millimeter Canon FD lens on my Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera. I just want to say that uh, I'm a very nice moment of my life because uh, things are going in the right direction for me. I have been a teacher this year and a filmmaker and I have survived in uh, Corona time but uh, my job as a teacher is, uh, is more or less finished. and. Uh, I've been stressing a little bit what to do and uh, stuff like that. Then my girlfriend sent me a course on Facebook from Bob Proctor about uh, financial freedom. And, um, and I took the course and uh, I took it serious. And uh, I've been doing what they have been saying, but of course, I see you now in later time that uh, I could have been even more serious than what I have been but I'm on the right track now and my brain has so many good ideas now there are so many things coming up to my brain and uh, especially one one thing I learned in the free course from Bob Proctor was about uh, 
what successful people do and what failure people do and it's one thing and it's pretty obvious now and I also knew it from before but I haven't been thinking so much about it and uh, it's one difference between successful people and failure is that it has something to do with decision successful people are doing decision very fast and when they have done it their decision very fast they stay on their decision and if they need to slow to change they change uh, slowly but what I what I have been doing is that I've been using a lot of time mm, should I do that should I do that should I be make a documentary about that and so on and then I'm uh, starting to think yeah maybe I go for that idea and then after some a month or something I changed my mind now oh, maybe it was a stupid idea and uh, I'm very happy I already knew about Bob Proctor and I've been watching some videos of him on YouTube and stuff like that but it's not the same when you take a course even if it's free or not when the decision is made that I'm going to take this course everything is different because I have been more concentrating that been listening more and I've been doing what he has been saying but if I'm going to be a little bit hard on myself I could have been taking this course even more serious than what I've been doing but I have done so many change since Monday now it's Sunday but I started on the Bob Proctor course on Monday and uh, so many changes Monday to Friday I wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning and in weekends I wake up at 8 o'clock in the morning maybe in the future I will change and I will wake up at 6 o'clock in the weekends as well it feels good to be on the right track so I just want to say Thank you, Bob Proctor, for having this free course. Mm -hmm.